Hey guys, I am Surbhi and once again welcome to my channel Key Differences. Today in this video, I am going to explain you the difference between microeconomics and macroeconomics. So friends, let's get started. Now first of all, we are going to understand the term economics. Economics is that branch of knowledge which studies the processes through which the resources that are scarce in nature are allocated to satisfy our most pressing unlimited wants. In other words, it studies the way we work together to transform the scarce resources into valuable and usable goods and services so as to satisfy the human wants. Now there are two branches of economics microeconomics and macroeconomics now we'll understand the term microeconomics microeconomics is that branch of economics which studies individual units such as a consumer household firm industry and price of a product microeconomics examines how the scarce resources are to be allocated among people efficiently so it covers product pricing consumer behavior factor pricing, firm's behavior, and industry location. Macroeconomics Macroeconomics is that branch of economics which deals with economy as a whole instead of individual aspects. Hence, here we are going to study the behavior of larger economic variables as in total consumption, total investment, total savings, etc. So, it analyzes the environment wherein the firm's households, consumers and government takes decisions. So macroeconomics covers national income, general price level, employment level, level of savings and investment, balance of trade and balance of payment. Difference between micro and macroeconomics Meaning Microeconomics deals with individual units and the effect of individual decisions regarding the allocation of scarce resources. On the other hand, macroeconomics deals with aggregate or large scale units, that is, the structure, behavior, and decision making in an economy as a whole. While the term micro is originated from a Greek term micro, which means small. Conversely, the word macro of macroeconomics is derived from a Greek term macro, which means large. When it comes to business application, Microeconomics applies to operational or internal issues as against macroeconomics can be applied to environment or external issues. Next, microeconomics is concerned with single economic variables such as demand, price, consumer, etc. On the other hand, macroeconomics is the study of aggregates. So, here the subject matter is national income aggregate savings, aggregate output, etc. The scope of macroeconomics is wider in comparison to microeconomics because microeconomics studies various economic problems at an individual level such as how the price of a particular commodity will affect its quantity demanded and quantity supplied as against macroeconomics deals with problems of the entire economy such as unemployment, monetary and fiscal policies, international trade and so forth. Microeconomics helps in coping with central economic problems such as price determination and allocation of resources. On the other hand, macroeconomics helps in determining the level of income and employment. Lastly, when it comes to importance, microeconomics ascertains the price of a product and other factors of production. Conversely, macroeconomics helps in maintaining stability in the general price level and resolves the major economic problems such as inflation, deflation, reflation, unemployment and poverty as a whole. Well guys, this brings me to the end of this lesson. I hope you find the lesson very useful. I am sure that all your doubts regarding the difference between micro and macroeconomics are cleared now. However, if you want to study the topic further in detail, please visit our official website that is keyreferences.com. Here you can find a detailed comparison of micro and macroeconomics along with their definitions, advantages and disadvantages, 
and similarities so guys please like and share this video and if you have any queries or feedback for me please comment below and do subscribe our channel for more updates i'll be back soon with a new lesson till then take care and bye bye